welcome to the Laminar Way. This is an introduction to data centers. First, a little bit about myself. Uh, my background is a uh, civil engineer, uh, but I've recently completed an MBA over the past year. Um, I've had five years as a project manager for a civil subcontractor, uh, mostly involved with TFL, Crossrail, uh, Thames Water and Tideway, so a lot of confined space work. Um, a year before that, I did an internship with Balfour BT in Malaysia, and this was on a, a year-long national rail project stretching from between Singapore and Thailand, and I got quite a lot of good experience. Um, other bits, I uh, enjoy cooking and baking. It's kind of something I've picked up from my grandparents, and yeah, I'm sure I'll start bringing treats into the office sometime soon, probably after the new year at this rate. Uh, keen DIY mechanic, you know, take things apart, put them back together, see how many screws you're left with at the end. And bouldering and rock climbing is something I've really got into over the past two or three years. And moving back to London, I'm starting to find a few places that I've kind of, well, just worth going to. All right, so an introduction to data centers. Um, so looking at my experience from civil engineering, kind of going into MEP and data centers specifically was very new to me. And there's a lot to pick up on the way. So we thought, well, why don't I put all the kind of the holistic view of what I've learned over the past two months into a project so that when anyone else starts off, they have a good place to start. They have some background knowledge, you're not going in blind and you have some idea of kind of what to Google if you're looking for more information. So split it up into three areas. The first two are quite brief. First, we'll look at where the industry currently is and where it's heading. Uh, then we'll spend a few slides looking at how developers approach DC projects and what they kind of keep in mind. And finally, we'll look at some of the core concepts and systems used and a little bit on how construction is carried out. Um, so the data center industry. Starting at the top, what is a data center? Um, and there's a quote from Cisco, at its simplest, a data center is a physical facility that organizations use to house their critical applications and data. There's kind of three main parts to the servers that are stored, and this is storage, compute power, and networking. Storage is traditionally hard drives or solid state drives. Occasionally tape storage is used, um, and it's currently still used because it's great for long, uh, if you're storing things for long durations, it's still being developed by IBM. They have 20 terabyte tape decks that they use. Uh, the access time and response time is rubbish, but for uh, read and writes, it's similar to hard drives. Uh, compute power, so CPUs, GPUs, and memory is becoming really popular as more people used to move to virtual machines and cloud computing. Uh, and these are quite power hungry uh, applications. So as we look at efficiency later, we'll see um, what the implications are for that. And finally, there's networking equipment, which is used to ensure it can, uh, the data center can talk to the outside world.